Marine is a city of dead children. Let's go kill some people, Beshka. I won't let you down. I know you won't. Oh, Beshka. I hope she at least gets to kill the master before, you know, she eats the bullet. <laughs> You shouldn't say that. <laughs> Why not? This guy looks old yeah. and creepy. I'll meet you inside. Yep, he's definitely old and creepy. What are you doing here? I have to get in there, Sarah. I know I'm not supposed to attend. But then you know Lady Marjorie doesn't want to see you. What could be so important? Her family! I need to speak with Lords Morgrin and Andros. One of them might be working against my family. Doing what? If I knew that, I wouldn't be uh, getting paid Look, I can't to do get something. In. Marjorie's really furious with you. And I'm not really interested in joining you on her bad side. Yeah. Please, Sarah. I'm not gonna threaten her. I know you're probably angry with me, but I need your help. I don't know. You should Please. know. Please and cheese. Fine. But you owe me, understand? I will give you an HJ later, okay? That means a job, which makes no sense because she's a girl. She's with me. We'll stay out of trouble. I promise. It's funny because we won't. Oh no. What's Marjorie gonna say? I'm sorry, Marjorie. I'm sorry, Mordrin. <laughs> <laughs> Feels a bit strange to celebrate, doesn't it? Yeah, no kidding. Not so long ago, King Joffrey sat on the Iron Throne. I'm not long ago, oh, that was. Now. Long may he reign. So far, so Sarah. good. I was worried you'd run off with your friend there. And what if I did? I'm not sure I could blame you. Ha <laughs> ha, it's this funny because it's creepy. Lady Mira Forrester. He's working against Mira, her family. Lord Garibald Tarwick. She's quite lovely. Where You're pretty you creepy. Her? <laughs> You're making her blush. <laughs> Sorry, Mira. <laughs> you flatter me. Sarah's lovelier than us all. I won't argue there. <clears throat> it's quite a feast, isn't it? Just be careful around the wine. It's spiked. I hear With drugs. you're partial to a particular arbor red. <laughs> it's easy to forget. Nothing you do in King's Landing goes on. Such unnoticed. as killing the Drink freaking guard captain guy. You're forever the drunken fool. Talk to the wrong people. Oh, and... Lord Tarwick. <laughs> LOL. That's awkward. Poor guy. It's like, what was that about? One guy, one Nothing. friend. That subject isn't fit for your delicate ears anyway. Oh, really? My ears are not delicate. Oh, of course listen. they are. Look how tiny they are. <laughs> Little lobes. Stop it. <laughs> so creepy. Ugh. I mean it. Is there someone you'd rather be talking to? <laughs> Unsure. My apologies. I just noticed Lord Zandros and Morgren over there. What a shame. Ruining a perfectly good afternoon with that nonsense. What nonsense? Perhaps I must know. Someone should encourage them to argue elsewhere. If you'll excuse me. This reminds me oh, of the tourney at Lannisport. You wouldn't believe it. Lannisport. What a stupid name. Lannister Point. Uh oh. Andros, you're being ridiculous. Ridiculous. <clears throat> well then, we learned a lot. Holy crap. Find out who is helping Lord Whittle. Holy crap, there's so many things going on. Hope Marjorie doesn't catch us. <laughs> oh, it looks so delicious. There's no time! I can't eat. Eating is for the pooples. I mean, peoples. <laughs> right here in the garden. Wasn't he Lannister? Was he? Uh -oh. One of their guards, but still. Surely they found who did. It was me. They haven't caught him yet. 
<laughs> him. It's funny because I'm a ninja. Dent, dent, dent. Oh, cool. I'm glad I was able to listen to the whole thing. Let's do it again. Let's hear them talk to the same about the same thing over and over again. <laughs> you can't even do it. It seems so calm out there. But it's not. Okay, I keep getting a little bit worried that um, I'm gonna get caught here. What's? Oh, that's the that's the decree. The Ironwood decree. Eh, you could eavesdrop, I guess. We're gonna go hide. Oh, I can't remember. I, I think it was a bird. I like birds. Oh, close. A cock. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's terrible. Oh. You're the one telling the joke, remember? That was. Uh, wow, he looked so amused by the joke. Eight out of eight, mate. Uh, I don't want to listen to them yet. Let's walk fast. Bye, assholes. Goodbye. Uh, I don't really care. Uh, things I don't care about. This is a very small feast. Very small amounts of people. Let's eavesdrop. I am an eavesdrop. <clears throat> it is a lot, but I know how to spend it. But how did you manage it? Magic! Lord Whitehill trusts <gasps> me above all others. That's why I'm the only one he's willing to... Well, I guess there we uh, go. An exclusive deal. How good for you, Andros. Well, I've got my family to consider. <laughs> it's funny because you're chubby. you even saw your wife, Andros? <laughs> Is that it? <laughs> when was the last time you saw your wife? No comment. Ooh, look at her dance sexually towards the, the camera. Quick you drop on Morgan. Let's see what he has to say. Are we, are we seriously hiding behind here again? And why would you ever stop dealing ironwood? Is there no longer a demand for it? I can't imagine that would be the case. <clears throat> no need for such wild speculation. I've simply lost interest. I'm moving on to better things, as they say. Hmm, and what would that be? Prostitutes! I mean, uh... I can see what you're doing. I'm not giving away my secrets just yet. That's cool. Well, I mean, there we go. Now let's go see if we can get him to help me for no reason at all. Hello, Morgan. Freeman. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please, if you'll excuse me. <laughs> so awkward. Lady Mira, I'm impressed. Impressed with what? That you aren't currently locked in a cell. I trust this means that you took care of that contract. How oh, did you I see. Do it, if I may ask, I wasn't expecting to see you again. If I'm being honest, you must have made good <coughs> work of it. If I tell you how I did it, what's in it for me? <laughs> Nothing. But I admire the gall. <laughs> I do stupid. believe King's Landing is rubbing off on you. So, what have you been up to? Killing people, you know. Enjoying yourself? Though I suppose if you're talking to me. I noticed you and Andros arguing earlier. I'm sorry you had to Andros. see Andros! I told him it I was just not can't something about Sir what Fox. What were you arguing about, if you don't mind my asking? Well, a bold question deserves a bold answer, doesn't it? <laughs> well, I mean, we know he's good. I've been pushed out of the ironwood business. I wonder oh. why. All thanks to my partner. Bloody imbecile. Andros is now Lud Whitehill's exclusive well, contact. So we could have learned King's that Landing. from him as well. Your job no seems so much easier, though. I introduced them in the first place. Why would Lord Andros want to push you? Oh, out? we do have a common enemy. We should definitely say we that. Found a man he could manipulate. Someone who wouldn't demand an equal share. Lyman Lannister. He's working with a Lannister. A Lannister, to be fair. Whatever Andros is up to. He clearly no. thinks Lyman can take my that place. That guy. I knew he'd be important. <laughs> Rickard, are you done flirting with that handmaiden? We need your opinion here. <laughs> Leave him alone. I wasn't done yet. I want to say I have a common Please enemy. Please excuse me. Well, I don't think that would have gotten anything anyways, but... Was, oh, no. I want to talk to Lud Ludwig. Freaking Ludwig, man. Could I talk to him again? I kind of want to see what he says if I mention... Lord Morgan. Lady Mira, I'm sorry, but I really can't talk now. <laughs> Say, go I'm away. sure you can find other ways to occupy your time. Oh, you can definitely see how he's pissed. He's like, leave me the hell alone, woman. Oh, well, I already eavesdropped. There's no point doing it. Well, Lord Andros. Mira Forrester. Uh oh. 
Did you come to poke your nose in my business once again? What are you talking about? You have a nasty habit of doing that. You're always so livid, Lord Andros. It can't be good for the Constitution. You think you can mock me? You have no <laughs> idea what you're up against. Well, Why don't you I do, me? she doesn't. All you need to know is I've got powerful friends, Lady Mira. Tyrion is the only Lannister interested in what I have to offer. Oh yeah. You don't we already did talk way, to this guy. You'll end up okay. in the black shells with the imp. Good day, Lady Mira. Good day to you, sir. All right. Well, that went well. I mean, I didn't didn't really expect anything out of him. So this is definitely the guy that I mean, he, he seems a fool, right? Um, excuse me. Lyman Lannister. <laughs> yeah. Shit. You startled me. As if I don't already have enough to deal with. Here, let me help. That's very kind of you. Thank you. But I'm fine. I just <clears throat> get clumsy sometimes. Oh, you're definitely nervous here. I'm... I'm afraid you have me at a disadvantage, Lady... Mira. Lady Mira. I am a forester. I'm not used to being approached yeah, yeah. so boldly. But I'm glad you did. Lonely? He is so I lonely. I out of place at big gatherings. Like Me this. too. They're the worst, aren't they? So he looks so weird, doesn't he? Over here. Jeez, man, why you have such a long I'm not face? The best company, I'm afraid. <laughs> or were you headed for the wire? He doesn't even know. really have a long From face. I, I, I don't know. You're <laughs> in the business of making rather important deals. Happen. Well, well, maybe he has a long face. I don't, I don't know. know. I'm so bad at Come seeing on. that kind of stuff. Don't be modest. I, I really shouldn't talk about it. Andros came to me in confidence. Well, it's you time understand. to be... He wouldn't be pleased, I'm sure. You can trust me, Lord Lyman. I won't tell anyone. I... Well... I suppose Lyman, I could just... What do you think you're doing? Uh oh What? Nothing. You stay away from him. Andros! We were just talking. You were just talking to Mira Forrester. Forrester? I... I didn't realize. My lord? Let me say this as plainly as I can. <clears throat> Don't ever meddle in my affairs again! Well then. Oh! I was gonna say, did she? I was looking around to see if she was around. Oh, she didn't catch me. That's uh, GTFO, right meow. I, my hands are on the keyboard. Oh, she's walking right towards me. Lady Marjorie. Oh, am I doing a disappearing act? Jump off! Jump off the cliff! Quick, they'll never see me in the water! Alright, I need a GTFO right meow. Lady Mira? That was quite a scene over there. Are you alright? No. I'm fine. I can handle Lord Andros. It's Lyman I was worried about. So what do you mean? Honestly, that story isn't fit for a maiden's ears. Did he rape a girl? Just be careful around him. How about we trade? There must be something I can tell you. There is well, something. Well, something about Sarah, obviously. I'm curious about Sarah. Dude, this is a bad spot Your to talk. help could save me a lot of embarrassment. Is she very interested in me? Lady Mira. That's exactly what I was going to ask. What do you want to know about Sarah? Sarah Durwell. Interesting name. Oh, that. I was going to ask if she's a bastard. Funny thing is, the last Durwells died off almost 200 years ago. What can you tell me about her family? Something isn't quite right. <clears throat> but I'm not sure. You must understand. I can't court a woman just because I like the way she laughs. I need to know her family, her parentage. I've met the Durwells when I was at Highgarden. Oh? They're a small well, house I mean, you know, uh, probably a bad well idea. Regarded. Ah, right. Well, that's a relief. For a moment, I thought... And now, Lord Tyler, uh... it's your turn. Right. Lyman Lannister. See, Ten it's either lose my lose Lyman my friendship with her. The tourney at Lannisport. He took a bag oh, yeah, from his horse. Needed milk oh, is he addicted to weeks, milk of the pop or something? Is that what he slipped? Oh. Is that what, it looked like he slipped something to his drink, and didn't it? Us, 
He's there never we stopped go. drinking the stuff. Can't stop, actually. He spent all his money trying to get more. The man yeah, can't go a day go. without it. I thought so. So that's why he shakes. You mustn't repeat that, Lady Mira. I shouldn't even know about it. I bet we're gonna overdose him. Lyman suffered enough embarrassment. Then why did you tell me? Because of well, maybe I shouldn't have. Oh. I'd my hate family. for Lord Andros to trace this back to me. Everybody likes my family. You learned that from Andros. The man's mouth is bigger than the black wall. <laughs> Poor Lyman okay. has no idea. So we're probably gonna kill Lyman then. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have Milk of the Poppy does kill make. people. I believe it's what's used to kill Lady Mira. <clears throat> when like, you know, when someone's on their deathbed and they've had enough pain. Oh boy. But where would we get milk of the poppy? <laughs> Probably a bad idea. Margie's definitely catching us. Lord Lyman, we really need to talk. I know what you're up to. I won't discuss my business with Andros, so please. Are we gonna please, tell him? Just leave me alone. Tell me to get milk of the poppy. We could do it somehow. You've landed me in enough trouble. Look at you. You're shaking. It's an old injury. But there's more to it than that, isn't there? What are you saying? Either tell me what you want, or go bother someone else. I don't have to stand Let's here and this. take this. Lord Andros has betrayed you. I know everything. What? What do you... The milk of the poppy. You drink it like wine. Ever since your injury at Lannisport. That is a bad yeah. idea. Andros wouldn't... He's not your friend. He's been using you. I trusted him. <laughs> he spilled your secrets. So why not spill his? Is he going to toss out his drink? I'm done with Andros this. Andros is hiring cell swords. Hundreds of them. Oh no. What? Oh no. He's building an army for Lord Whitehill, big enough to march against Ironrath. But Andros is doing it in secret. No one knows. Or at least, he doesn't want anyone to know. I told him I'd keep quiet, but... Lord Whitehill won't be slaughtering anybody. With an army that size, he'll slaughter whoever he wants. Well, hundreds of self swords. It's really not really that big, you know. You bloody traitor. You promised me. Then you told everyone? What are you talking about? You're a liar. I should never have trusted you. She told me everything. <laughs> LOL Smile Let's give him a little smile Oh, he's gonna be stopped Lady Mira You've just made a very grave error Very grave indeed You realize that, I hope Don't tell me you're afraid of a handmaiden <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna get slapped or something Oh, he's red Get out of here. Oh boy, I think we need to send a raven. Oh boy. Crazy times, crazy times. Eh, I guess we killed all the ravens, but we could still get them. I guess, yeah, I never really. I guess they killed all the ravens just in case sure one of them gets out. Going. Or they somehow sneak to a raven somehow. Potter? No, he has no idea. <laughs> Let's see that map again. So you're asking now, are you? Surprised you haven't taken it from my pocket already. Oh, come on, dude. How much food we got left? Not very much, probably. Here we are. Carried. How was uh, the food? There's no point in lying. Why would we this lie about that? This won't last much longer. If Finn wasn't eating all of it. Hello, snappers. It's not me. Did his mouth not move? We'll have to stop <laughs> soon. Look for some food. <laughs> We're on the right track. Your face is this on the way. right track. 
He has no idea where the hell. Whoa, a bear! A bear! Uh, we're gonna run the wildlings, aren't we? Free folk. It's Yigrit! Actually, it could be, potentially. <laughs> You stay here. I'll try and talk to her. I'm one of them. Oh, you're dead, Wait, dude. What? It's a fucking wildling, Cotter. They might kick me around a little, but whatever you do, don't come out, all right? She has to think I'm alone. If she sees you, you'll only make things worse. Oh, man. He's gonna get caught and he's gonna get punched and we're gonna get the option to either leave him. We don't think. No, I'm, uh, I'm a friend. I grew up near Ardholm. You know it? I won't hurt you. All right. You won't. I'm one of you. I'm. Oh! oh. You sure look like a crow oh, to I'm me. Not. You're dressed like one. You out here all alone, little pup. Come out or I'll kill your friend! Or I'll make him scream first. Listen! I don't want to Let's fight. Stay hidden. Then you shouldn't have come here. He'll be all right. Won't no he? idea. Ha! Ha! Oh! Stop! Please! You don't like it. 